Hey everybody, welcome to another week here at the Tiroler Inn. Last couple days I had a few guys help me and we carried all the wood from the attic down into the basement. I am going to try to clean up here and then do the layout. Maybe start already with some of the framing up here so that we can on the weekend finish all the plumbing. I did get a new vacuum. This thing is amazing. Six and a half horsepower. It's called the Beast. I'm um, not sponsored or anything, but this thing is really doing its job, especially together with a cyclone like this. I haven't had to empty the vacuum over here, and I probably don't even have more than half a bucket of dirt in here, but it has so much suction power. I'm using actually one of the wider nozzles and I can just go in. Even the little cracks everywhere, everything comes right out. This is really a big improvement from the small one that I had before. Should have probably got one of those months ago. were pretty tiring. I've been carrying all the wood down from the attic out into the basement. Luckily I had some people helping me but today I cleaned up the rest of the attic here. It's probably as clean as it hasn't been in 100 years. I vacuumed the entire place. I took the carpets out took all the last few pieces of wood that were all over the place. I took that all down. Actually, I threw it all down still. And the worst thing about up here today is really that it's probably 120 degrees in here and totally humid. Outside, it's already 90, probably 95 and 80, 90% humidity. So up here in the attic, no insulation, sun completely all day onto the roof. So now it's unbearable almost. So it's 4.30 in the afternoon. I really need to pack up and I'm just exhausted. Hopefully overnight it cools down a little bit. I want to get somebody who can help me carry up some new lumber. It's obviously expensive right now, but I gotta start raising some of the walls. We made a plan for the basic walls. We haven't finalized it all, but I at least know where I can start tomorrow over here. The basic wall for the wardrobe and the outside of the hallway and bathroom has been established. And then the interior walls 
I'll just do those afterwards. So I have the last few days here of my vacation, just this last weekend, Memorial Day weekend. I hope I get two days to spend up here and do some work, finish the walls and put a video together. I can't promise anything. We have a few things that we are planning to do. So we'll see how it goes. And overall, vacation was good. Took some time off to spend at the lake with Julie and some friends and the kids. That was really good. We also did some fun things like we went strawberry picking one of the weeks and just take some time and relax together. And then obviously we made pretty good progress up here in the attic. Uh, not a project that we were planning on doing right now, but ready to finish the plumbing. We figured it had to be done right now. So just something that had to be fit in and I'm pretty happy. I think the majority has been done. Just have to finish some of the framing and then obviously the plumbing next week. So I'm glad I got some time to spend and I hope sometime in the fall later when my parents come, when COVID restrictions are lifted and people from Europe can travel again to the US that when they're coming, we we'll might be able to spend some extra time up here in, in the house and get some more th things done. But we'll see. You might be wondering why I took the wall down around the staircase. Well, it's plain and simple. It was just a one by material wall and therefore I am going to actually frame it and then we're gonna drive off on the inside. The other, other reason here is we want to also insulate the rafters right here. So I'm gonna eventually also take the leftover pieces over here off so that we can insulate obviously in the staircase too. So next step, is I need to put three walls, one here, one here, and then obviously the doorway plus the small wall over here on the left, on the right or left, your left side to finish this. 
and I need to mount obviously the railing to it again. Obviously this is loose right now, but I had to take it down of course to redo the wall completely. Just finished framing the entry area we are not going to add a door here because we're going to have a hallway that kind of puts you up into a landing before you enter the master so we don't really need a door here this is just the hallway going downstairs one thing I haven't finished yet is the detail over here um, so I basically need to now draw out the wall on the floor that I need to put right straight over where the bathroom is going to go on this side and then the closet is going to follow right after the bathroom so I need to lay that out I need to figure out where the door opening is so that I can cut all the lumber to pieces put the wall together and then stand it up so obviously right here the wall is not gonna uh, the wall has to have some kind of detail to get around this beam and shafter so that's one of the things that I just have to figure out as we go.
I think the layout is a little clearer now. What we will have is, we'll have a walk-in closet over in this direction. We'll have a bathroom, a vanity on this side, a shower and a toilet, and then here a utility closet for the AC and heat pump up in the attic. And then over in the rest of the room is kind of the open concept room for our master slash office room. So right now I have about eight foot walls. Uh, we're not 100% sure yet how we're going to finish them all the way up to the ceiling. If they're just going to go straight up, potentially we might angle them to open up the main room a little more or potentially even a flat roof right on top of it or maybe we store some of our extra things like Christmas things or anything like that. But we are not 100% sure yet how we got to lay that out. So that's the reason why I have only made eight foot walls so far and then we will go from here and make the decision probably by next week. You, may, <clears throat> you might be able to tell I'm pretty exhausted. The last few days have been a lot. Monday, Tuesday, I carried all the wood with some people down into the basement and then Yesterday I cleaned up the rest of the space, took down the rest of the walls that I still needed to do. And then today I took down the wall around the stairs and then started framing up the walls. It is, I think, almost 5 o'clock. I really need to go home. Julie has an appointment later. So I think that's it for this week. I will see you guys next time I turn on the camera. Bye. Thanks.